I'm going to need you to take a seat. And i got some really bad news for you guys. Um, you sat? <sighs> I don't know how to tell you this, but... It's been a, a, a tragedy. Um, Vince McMahon has realised what NXT is, and he has decided to kill it. NXT is dead. Is that a bit morbid? Probably a bit morbid. Hi, ladies and gentlemen, my name is Potato Chief, and I wanted to make a video about the death of NXT. At least the NXT that we know. Um, so, NXT has been quite possibly the greatest wrestling promotion in the world for the last couple of years and now it's dead it's been destroyed it's been rebuilt repackaged and rebranded and restarted rebooted into the image of what Vince McMahon wants it is going back to F to OVW uh, to Florida Championship Wrestling, FCW. That's what I was trying to remember the name of. OVW. Uh, just traditional developmental. Uh, no more Nakamura's. No more Kenta's. No more Finn Balor's. No more Adam Cole. Baby. Uh, NXT will now be the place where they will no longer have and I quote, midgets and people over the age of 30. So we are going back to the early days of NXT where it was just all muscle-bound NFL rejects. And it's a very sad day because honestly, I feel like NXT was the best show in professional wrestling for a, a, a period of time, for about three years. We had amazing shows every single every single takeover was a classic we've had 36 takeovers and we're about to have the 36 takeover and i don't think we've ever had a bad takeover um, I, as far as i'm concerned we've never had a bad takeover and um, it's a sad day uh we don't know how drastic this change is going to be i don't know if it's going to be takeover 36 and then Literally, the next episode of NXT, everyone who's established is gone. And now we have just young, I said NFL rejects uh, on the roster, and that's it. And none of the actual talented wrestlers are going to be there anymore. And it's just going to be essentially main roster light. Uh, the main roster, but even worse. And uh, if there's a positive I can get out of this, it's two hours less of wrestling I need to watch every week because NXT was enjoyable, but it was a never. It was. You had three hours of Raw, two hours of SmackDown, two hours of NXT, two hours of AEW. And also, you know, you get Impact and you get all the other stuff as well. But the point being, it is. A, I'm going off on a rant here. This video was kind of just me ranting. I. I would like to do video essays and stuff, but I haven't got the attention span for that. I need to just kind of just talk to you, talk at you. I need to get stuff off my mind. That's how I work. And this is why I do reaction videos, because it's just... Oh, my, my light is gone. And this is... <laughs> this is what I'm, I'm talking about. I'm, 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 I'm a bit of, this is a bit of a rambly video, but I just I wanted to eulogize and talk about how great NXT used to be. Um... Kevin Owens from it, and my dog decided to wake up now. I don't know why she just suddenly just got up and started being naughty. Anyway, sorry. Oh, where was I? Um, I love NXT. I, I, the, it was one of my favourite shows I've ever been to was when NXT came to Cardiff and we started the Hey, we want some Bailey and Hey, Hey, Bailey chants. That was before NXT. Uh, Takeover, uh, Takeover London, which was fantastic. Takeover. Um, I'm rambling a lot. I'm sorry, but it's just it's a sad day. It's a really sad day. Um, I'm thinking I might do a top five list of my favorite NXT matches of all time. If you guys would be interested in seeing that, let me know in the comments below. Uh, but I just wanted to talk about NXT, and I wanted to see what you you guys think of NXT and what you think of this shocking new direction. 
and the basically the death of what we've enjoyed. Uh, I, I obviously if it, if it goes the way I think it is, if it's just going to be like a velocity or a main event or like just a, a heat, like just another small show with just developmental stuff, I won't be watching it anymore. I, it's like it feels like WWE are trying to push people to AEW. It's very strange. Um, obviously, this is all due to the fact that NXT lost the Wednesday Night War, but I feel like they put them up against AEW, they put them up against an opponent that had more financial backing, had uh, like a more of a like a, a fresh appeal to it. Uh and they like I feel like NXT kinda of, like WWE just kind of shot the shot the kneecaps out from NXT and just sent them out. I feel like they didn't give them the real support they needed to actually beat AEW and then when they didn't beat AEW, this is what happens. Uh is <sighs> You had NXT was the Ring of Honor, the PWG of WWE, and then AEW came around, and it was like, well, we'll have the 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 look, the appeal, and the the staging and the money of like a main roster WWE show, but with all the PWG Ring of Honor stuff, and NXT was just kind of still felt small. We were stuck in the performance center, and it never really grew out of that. Uh, I don't know if COVID would have helped or not, or hindered it. Uh, I don't know if they would have changed anything, but it's. I don't, this is a rant of a video. I'm sorry. It's, not, it's really, really inco incoherent. I'm just off going off on different tangents every two seconds. But yeah, I was like, I loved NXT, and the fact that it's gonna be dead after NXT Takeover Thirty Six. I, we got about two weeks left of it being normal NXT, and then it's going downhill. Um, maybe I'm cynical. Maybe maybe I'm maybe I'm wrong. Maybe it will be fantastic because we, with the WWE style of NFL guys, you have had some good wrestlers come through that system, that way of wrestling. So it's possible we might still get a good product out of it. But I, I'm I'm cynical and uh, it's I'm really sad because I really loved NXT and it was a, such an amazing show and will it be ever as good again? Maybe. Uh, will Vince change his mind and go back to what Triple H wanted, what Hunter wanted? Uh, I don't know. Will will it will it be better? Or worse, I'm assuming it's going to be worse, but I'm just maybe that's just me being cynical. What do you guys think? Are you excited or are you sad? I'm are you sad like me <laughs> that you this is the end of probably the greatest brand of WWE programming they have done since the Attitude Era and probably maybe even better some of the stuff in the Attitude Era. Probably the greatest thing the WWE's done for a very long time is now coming to an end. Let me know what you think in the comments below. What was your favourite NXT moment? What was your favourite NXT match? Would you like to see my top five NXT matches of all time? I will come around and do that if I can get around to it. Um, I'm actually genuinely sad thinking about this. And it really breaks my heart a little bit. What do you guys think? Uh, how do you feel? Let me know in the comments below. And I will respond to all your comments because I always do. Um, thank you for watching <laughs> Just watching me rant at the camera. I might try to do more stuff like this in the future. Um, I would like to do more stuff like this in the future. So let me know what you think in the comments below. And thank you guys for watching. And until next time. NXT. 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 <laughs>
join Potato Club today and too sweet that subscribe button.